Here we go. Okay, so um, inside of the book, The Art of Impossible, there is a 90 to 120 minutes of focus time every single day, right? Working on an activity that we can focus on and we focus on it, we want to do more of it later. And um, I did this morning, I sat down and started doing some research on blog posts, and looked through some websites that I went through before, um, like uh, Flippa, and was like, eh, how are people actually doing this type of work out there in the world? And then, um, yeah, I was like, I spent 90 minutes on it first thing in the morning. And um, the other option would have been to, um, uh, like, how do I improve the work that I did yesterday to make it better today. That would have been another thing. Like, let's actually look at our work and the stuff that we created yesterday and what are the stuff that we can do while we're on the internet um, to do that work. And then number three, the real one is go out and create more stuff. Um, and I think the variables that go along with it is if I've got to, if I have a commitment, um, if I've got a commitment, it's either a commitment to family or a commitment to um, to work or anything else, then I can't be doing that. Um, then, you know, I've just got to be sitting on a laptop. If um, there's people that are present, I've got to be quiet. But the other times I get out there and just doing, doing recordings and doing creating, because that seems to create the most amount of karmic momentum that's out there in the world. And then it gets shipped out in a way that is um, potentially impactful only even if it's potentially impactful just from a vanity metrics perspective so i've been going on a walk for eh, close to an hour right now and inside i've walked number one and so yeah i'm recording an outdoor walk so i've been walking for 38 minutes which is great i'm hitting my minutes exercise goal for the day i can add some weight on top of this turn this actually into a real workout on um yeah a real workout on the back end and then number three is um yeah turn to a real workout on the back end start measuring where we're starting to have impact and then number four is um yeah number four is uh i'm getting like real um stuff that's out there right and creating a whole bunch of stuff and creating a whole bunch of words and right i just need to convince myself a couple of times through metrics of what the value of this is oh and so the vanity metrics piece of it is Right, it looks like I created what I create. I created 15 blog posts or 15 blog posts. I created 15 podcasts all while going on a 40 minute walk. And the alternative, what we would have done during this period of time is I would have, uh, um, and I can do it again later on today. Um, the alternative, what we would have done during this period is to, uh, um, the alternative would have been to listen to a podcast or to do something else right so we start creating much larger impact uh yeah much larger impact and um and that's exciting and that's uh that's fun that's motivating right and i do like the idea of partnering with other people inside the stuff that we're creating and um yeah yeah start partnering with other people inside the stuff we're creating and start sharing it out so inside of the art of impossible doing 90 to 120 minutes walking and recording each day is really extremely powerful and we'll get better at it. The speaking will get better. The ideas will get better. The connections will get better. The energy will get better, right? Um, that's something you can do late at night. This is the one thing that you can do late at night and probably everything else is just a, um, yeah, everything else is just a, uh, um, uh, might just be a distraction. That's why those are like, energy detractor like we we leave we exit with more energy than um, we started with and it might be you know might be a way to start to tokenize these audio messages and um yeah start tokenizing these audio messages and that, that that's a possibility and then have them owned by other people and yeah and, and created by other people and that might be um a source of what we want to do but we want to have our mind as free as possible just to um literally have it unloaded onto, I don't know if it's unloaded onto the world, but unloaded out through these messages. And then we want to get more pure information coming in through books. Um, that's cool. That's fun. That's exciting. That is something that's worth spending a couple of years on 
uh, yeah, something worth spending a couple of years on and just imagine where it'd be right today if it just continued to work along that path. And uh, yeah, we'll speak soon. Have an amazing day.